I just want to share um, some aluminium free deodorant products which I have so I've got the Walida one it's a sage deodorant and it does have alcohol in there though water fragrance sage oil Lemonine, benzene, benzoate, coumarin. Um, this is Aloe Shield deodorant stick from Forever brand. And it doesn't have any aluminium salts in there. That has glycol, aqua, sodium stearate, aloe barbensis, leaf juice. Aloe vera gel, some fragrance, and triclosan. And this one is from the Dr. Organics range. I'm trying to get this to focus, that's why. Really... Virgin coconut oil deodorant. Um, again, so this is also aluminium free. SLS free, paraben free, and this one says it's alcohol free. Um, yeah, so anyway, these are three deodorants that I picked up a while ago. Um, I tend to kind of just stock up on things, so I don't tend to shop very often. Um, and these are going to last me a long time. Uh, another alternative um, is as much as possible to go without wearing deodorant where you can possibly do that it's not always possible but um you know so and lemon cutting a lemon in half and literally just wiping your armpits with that that's another alternative which probably even sort of got less chemicals than anything else um so the cleanest way of doing it so but not I have tried doing that a couple of times. Um, it's actually not too bad. Um, sometimes you might feel it's a bit sticky there, but generally it's it's uh, it's avoiding really using a lot of these products as much as possible. Um, and you kind of want to let your armpits breathe, so to speak, because otherwise you're just blocking up the your pores there and your lymphatic system. You know, the whole point of sweating is to eliminate the toxins. Um, so yeah, I only use these deodorants when I really need to be using them, if that makes sense. If I'm just around in the home, I'm not going to, um, be using deodorant. Um, I'll use the lemon and if I have to be somewhere where I'm going to be up close next to people, then that's when these deodorant sticks come out. Um, so anyway, I just thought I'd share, sorry about the shadow here, I've had to use the light. Um, we can see that bit better there. Just trying to take the shadow away from there. Um, yeah, because it's a very, it's daylight, but it's so dark outside. Um, winter, I don't know, it's just got that winter grey. There's not much light coming in the home, so I've just had to turn the light on. Um, but anyway, I, I just wanted to, to film this just while I was doing the toothpaste in the other video I did. Um, the fluoride free toothpaste. So I just wanted to share that, these products while I still have them. Um, because people sometimes are, are looking for something aluminium free and they don't always know what products are out there. So these are three that I found. There's probably others out there as well, but these are ones that I managed to pick up and I these are going to last me a long, long time. Uh, so, yeah. Anyway, I hope you find this video helpful and useful. And if you are still using the normal antiperspirants and deodorants, I really would urge you to kind of get away from using them and switch to aluminium free um, deodorant because it really isn't good for you. Um, and like I said, where you can let your armpits breathe on your weekends off or, you know, when you're not working, do try and do that. Um, or or even use a fresh lemon. Literally, just cut it in half and you just wipe it under there. Um, 
so yeah all right okay thank you bye